Hello friends, today we discuss how to find out the compound interest using math script window. So first of all, I just go to structures, math script window, over here, this is my math script window. So for the compound interest, we have a formula A is equal to P into parenthesis in between 1 plus r divided by 100 whole p. So first I have to calculate the power of 1 plus r divided by 100 which raised to t. So for that purpose I just use a variable h that is equal to 1 plus r divided by 100 or here r is my add input r is my interest okay so now i want to calculate the power because t is raised to 1 plus r raised to 100 so to calculate this let's say i have another variable g that is equal to power this is my function that is used in math script window so power of h into t h comma t okay so it will give me the power 1 plus r divided by 100 raised to t so now my formula is amount it is equal to principal into g so now I just add input that is my principal I want to just add input that is my time t and over here I just add output that is my amount this is my output so over here I just create indicator so this is complex value so I just change it to dbl value so over here I just create control for rate of interest create control for principal create control for the time so control T control U it will minimize my function let's say I want to find out also the compound interest so CI is my compound interest it is equal to amount minus principal so I just add one more output over here that is my compound interest so it will give me the compound interest again I just change it to double precision so as you see over here in this case so when I put some value inside it let's say rate of interest is 10 percent principal amount is 100 and rate of in time is 1 so in this case amount should be 110 and the compound interest should be 10 so as you see so if you want to go for multiple more than one year it is now it is two year so check the output is 121 and compound interest is 21 so this is how you can work with math script window in lab view thank you